welcome to 2016! Yes, you're the next contestant on Crafts with Mitch. Hey guys, welcome to Why So Curious. It's Mitch. Happy New Year, you guys. Welcome to 2016. So today, I wanted to chat with you guys while I did some crafts, and you guys will see what comes from it. I should come up with like a really neat sort of like theme for it. Maybe we could call it like crafts and craps, or crafts and drafts. Maybe, no. I'm not that dedicated, sorry. But anyways, Let's get started. So we all set these New Year's resolutions, right? What they're gonna get done, what they're gonna like change about themselves. Maybe you wanna go to the gym more, or you wanna lose some weight, focus on a project that you haven't touched in a long time and finish it. Or maybe you just wanna stop binge watching Netflix and spending more than six hours on your phone at a time. Markers. I feel like I'm in sixth grade, I love it. In the end of the year, you think about things, and sometimes you don't really reach those goals that you set for yourself. And it feels crappy. You can be really disappointed in yourself. And you lose track of all the good things that happened to you in a year. All the amazing things that you learned, and the new stuff that you experienced. Guys, that was a mouse. That was like a real mouse. You're gonna die! But anyways. No! Why does this always happen with tape? Ah, it got stuck to one side. And it just keeps on going. Rolling it up into a ball now. That's what's happening. What I am proposing to you guys is, instead of having just that general old guilt and kind of shame from not accomplishing your New Year's resolution, instead, I want you to add something to your New Year's resolution that you're going to try and do during the year. You're going to take like a bucket or a jar or something. I am using an ice cream bucket. It's fat free. Don't judge me. Oh my god, I cut out the fat free. That's such a fat. Hey, big is beautiful. Every single time something really, really good happens to you or something really awesome comes into your life. Every time that something like that happens, write it down on a little piece of paper and put it inside that bucket or that jar or whatever. Put all the good stuff in it. Write down every single good thing that happens to you in the year. At the end of the year, even if you don't accomplish your New Year's resolution or whatever you set out to do, what's gonna happen is you're gonna go through that bucket and you're going to remember, oh wow, that's really loud and really obnoxious. So instead of like feeling really bad about the things that you didn't get done, go through everything that you put in this bucket every single time that you wrote something down, go through all of them and read the amazing year that you had. All of the amazing things that happened to you in the year as you read them will kind of erase all of the guilt and stuff that you felt about maybe not finishing your resolution or just a crummy year that you had. Is such a oh no I did it again the tape I love this idea I think it's awesome and you know what I'm naming mine the best year ever bucket Bam. I saw a bird in the sky it reminded me of you Send me a comment below about some of the good things that happened to you in this past year that you might have put in your container. Click the thumbs up if you like the video, and also do not forget to subscribe to Why So Aquarius if you want to see my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful face every Friday. I will see you guys next Friday. Happy New Year, welcome to 2016, and I love you so much. Oh god, my this shirt is too restrictive, I can't do this today. I love you. Bye. No, I'm gonna get an eraser.